Understanding Injury Time in Sports Hello everyone, and welcome to our English Language Learning Series. Today, we're going to explore a fascinating phrase used in sports, injury time. This term is not only interesting in itself, but it also gives us a glimpse into how language can be specific to certain contexts, like sports. So, let's dive in and understand what injury time means and how it's used. Injury time, also known as stoppage time or added time, is a term commonly used in football, soccer. It refers to the additional minutes added to the end of each half of the game. These extra minutes compensate for time lost due to injuries, substitutions, or any other significant delays that occur during regular playtime. It's crucial in close matches, as it can be an opportunity for teams to change the outcome of the game. The determination of injury time is the responsibility of the referee. The referee estimates the total time lost during each half and adds that time to the end of the 45-minute halves. The added time is usually a few minutes, rarely exceeding five. It's important to note that this time is not fixed and varies from game to game, depending on the circumstances. Injury time can be a critical period in a football match. It's often seen as a last chance for trailing teams to equalize or win the game. Conversely, for the leading team, it's about defending their lead. Dramatic goals and unexpected turns often happen during injury time, making it a thrilling aspect of the sport. While injury time is a sport-specific term, it's sometimes used metaphorically in everyday language. For instance, someone might say they're in the injury time of a project, implying they're in the final, crucial stages of completion, often with added pressure or urgency. I hope this video has helped you understand the phrase injury time and its significance in football. Remember, Language is not just about words but also about the context in which they are used. Stay tuned for more interesting English language insights in our upcoming videos. Happy learning, and see you next time!